hello everybody and welcome back to my channel it's your girl simone nicole today we are going to be doing a packed and productive day in my life also we're listening to the rebel king right now by kennedy ryan first of all shout out to my friend taylor that put me on a kennedy ryan please such a good writer anyways we're gonna start out our day with oral care as you know one does also i'm making that face because you know kennedy ryan books be spicy she write she write them scenes real good we are starting out with oral care i like to oil pull then do my like water pick and then everything else next we're gonna do just a bit of skincare i tried to like keep this skincare in this video short because i'm pretty sure i'm gonna do an updated skincare routine but like winter edition and i'm gonna do that during the month of december because y'all know that the content is gonna go crazy in december so if that's something that y'all are excited about seeing or are interested in then just let me know in the comment section but all of these products of course will be linked down in my description box I get this question like here and there on socials about like, why do I use nipple cream on my lips? Girl, if you know, you know. Nipple cream is the best. I, I don't care about whatever other product y'all talk about. Nipple cream to the day I die. The most moisturizing thing ever in life. And then of course we have to top everything off with sunscreen and lip gloss. And this is how we are looking. Now let's make this bed. I make my bed every single morning and I know that y'all think it's very stereotypical of all these vlogs of the girls doing a day in the life and we always make our bed. It is really rooted in the fact that it's a habit and it just makes me feel good whenever I do it. I am intentional about doing that every single morning. Girl, I'm down bad when I don't make my bed in the morning, but that's, that's neither here nor there. I'm also working on a video where I show y'all like redoing my bedroom, but I've like kind of been wrestling with that concept because I am moving out of my apartment and then next four months so i've just been a little demotivated but maybe i'll still do that video who knows now we're getting dressed we're gonna keep the fit pretty simple just leggings and a hoodie and then we're gonna tackle this hair my hair looks so good this was a braid out from have y'all seen this sponsorship this was a sponsorship with shea moisture and the hair is eating because of course it is so we are just gonna do this little hair slick these little baby hairs down and get ready to go because we are working out of a coffee shop today period montage so let's get to work the way that my brain works and how i'm able to be so productive is that i write things down like i have a physical to-do list every single day well every single day i want to be productive i'm not gonna hold you first on the list is me getting a tiktok edited and up this is my first tiktok edit of the day i'm going to be editing multiple ones today and in between shots you'll see me writing down more to do and that's because my brain like will pop up things to do and i don't want to forget so i'll write them down then at this point we found a table so we moved to a table now we are posting this tiktok well we're not posting it we're actually going to schedule it to post tiktok doesn't have the schedule feature on mobile which is yet yeah, so uh, so i have to like set a timer which is cool so now i am going to start why i really came here which is finishing off the edit for my youtube video that was going up that day i was working on my pretty privilege video and y'all loved that video thank you so much for all the love and all of the like constructive comments as well or anybody just disagreeing in general i love to start a conversation i'm not coming here to be right i'm coming here to have a conversation so that went really well next we're gonna work on my instagram post for today these are pictures that were taken at a friends giving event by lys and i wanted to schedule those to go up but instagram scheduler is ass and it says it didn't schedule but it did so i left that and just made a mental note just to make sure that it posted now I'm gonna go to LTK and I'm gonna make a post that essentially links out all of my outfit because I knew that my LTK rep was going to be on me to make sure that I did that. And I just don't wanna leave no money on the table, babes. So we're getting that done and then getting that scheduled to also go up at the same time as my YouTube video so that when I post the picture, I can also post that link to my story so that they go up at the same time. And as you can see, I'm crossing things off the list. The only thing left on the list is for me to like text my friends, <laughs> which I do have to literally put on the list to do because you're probably getting busy. Now we are all done for the day. I'm gonna pack up and we're gonna actually head to go get some food because it is now four o'clock. 
I was really like on oh my Zoom, babe. So I did not eat this entire day. So I'm actually gonna stop at Chipotle on the way home and I'm going to get two, count them, two hard tacos because I knew that wouldn't fill me up. It would just, you know, give me a little something to nibble on. And then we're gonna go to Publix because this is actually right before I leave to go back to Cleveland for Thanksgiving. I knew I wanted to cook dinner, but I knew I didn't wanna like go full on grocery shopping. I just got literally what I needed to make dinner for tonight, which was one red potato and some green beans. And that was it. And now we are headed back home. I'm about to sit down and eat my two tacos. Child, the stuff to be going on in this just your cat is crazy. But anyways, ate those down. Yum. Now I'm gonna sit on the couch and do some more work because I knew I had a ton of work still ahead of me, which is fine. I have been committed to responding to y'all in my comment sections of my YouTube videos. So I have committed that like the entire first like day that the video is up, I will be in the comment section responding to you guys. But of course my child can't let me be great. Get down, get down. Tootie, get down. Deborah. Please. Tootie. Why is you in your mother's business? Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Thank you, Tootie. Now I am going into TikTok to schedule another post to go up. I'm pretty sure that this was sponsored content that I needed to just like make sure was scheduled to go up so that I was like ahead of myself tomorrow and then again i set an alarm to make sure that that went up tomorrow and if y'all think i'm on it please listen to how my team be on me y'all this is exactly what i mean i'm going through my comments on instagram this is literally my ltk rep being like "Ooh, period where can i find this look like she don't play with me about linking and get my money <laughs> i am trying to decide what outfit I should wear for Thanksgiving because I was on my good sis Kyra's TikTok and I remember her wearing this set and then she also just posted a new video where she was wearing like another gray set towards the end and she looked so good. I'm trying to decide between the two. By the time y'all see this, I will have already picked, but I'm wondering which one y'all would have picked for me. Like, should I do this two piece green number? And I wouldn't wear it like, like that, obviously. I would zip it at the bottom. Or should I do this number, this little set? Cause that would be cute, but I'm gonna be eating on Thanksgiving and I kind of want to be comfortable, but this is such a cute freaking set. Either way, I gotta order something. So let me know down below what you think I ordered. Anywho, we got our Thanksgiving outfit ordered because we are about to go home for Thanksgiving in real time here. So before I go pack to go home, I'm actually going to do a little bit of cleaning. So I'm unloading my dishwasher, then, you know, reloading my dishwasher because I like to come home to a clean home. But actually my friends are gonna be coming over to keep an eye on my little Debbie cakes while I'm out of town. So I just wanna make sure that my house is nice and clean for them while they are here in my absence. And once I'm done loading the dishwasher, I'm going to start dinner. Tonight was some little chicken wings. So I wanted to make sure to put the wings on and to put my potato on in advance because baking, like physically baking chicken wings versus putting them in the air fryer just tastes better to me. Let me know down in the comments if you agree with me because it's definitely a slower way to cook, but sometimes I be needing more time to cook because I'd be multitasking and this was just one of those days. So I seasoned up my little wang dangs and then I put my potato in the oven actually first before my wings went in the oven. And again, I never put my potatoes in the oven, but in my last apartment, I didn't have a microwave, so I had no choice. And I was just like, whoa, potatoes are like 10 times better in the oven. So that's done. Now let's pack. And here comes my baby. She be acting like she don't want to be by me, but she love me real deep. Just me and my twin in them. Go best friend, we killing them. All these little bitches, yeah, I'm feeling them. I ain't feeling them. It's just me and my twin in them. All right, bye. Bye, sister. Y'all be missing the parts so where she be all up on me. Now, let's get to packing, which is something that I was like dreading doing and clearly something that Lil Deb doesn't want me to do. So at first I just started out by packing around her. We're gonna start out with our makeup and then build off of that. I don't, I don't know how to describe the way I pack. I don't think it's like super duper organized. I think I just 
think about like myself getting dressed and what that requires and then I pack in that order and this was a tight fit I need new luggage real bad so the only thing that I like have is my carry-on luggage so it's always a tight fit when I'm traveling but hopefully somebody gets me some new luggage anybody listening to this that loves me that's in my family or friends um if you want to give me new luggage love you thank you so much so now packing is all done so let's head back in the kitchen chat I am searing up the green beans that we bought. And then I'm just gonna dress my little potato. I like to keep it simple, just a little butter, a little sour cream, a little salt pepper. And that's gonna do it for me every single time, especially a red skin potato. I mean, the only thing better is the yellow skin, but they're kind of even to me. Anyways, um, then I just put everything else on the plate. I did hot wings this night. It was just so delicious. Looking back at this video, I just wanna remake this meal because my mouth is watering. So we enjoyed dinner. Now we are going to get in the shower and do our nighttime skincare. Again, like I said, I am going to be just zooming through this routine more so because I'm, like I said, I'm going to do the in-depth video about how I take care of my skin in the wintertime. And I don't know if you guys can tell, but like if you look close on my skin, I have like these dark patches and it's because a brand has sent me some hydrochloric acid, you know, the pimple patches. And it actually like ended up making a dark circle over the pimple which sucks but it's okay we have products in order to reverse that i just know not to use that brand again so i'll be working on that and then showing y'all like the process of that in that video so be looking out for that skincare routine now i'm all done and that is gonna wrap up our night remember that if your day wasn't as productive as mine that's okay this is me at my best and remember that social media is always just us at our best i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you super duper soon in the next one bye guys Girl, I got the money, we'll see me to mine, oh. If you love me, never feel me to mine, oh.